Hello, I'm David Huber. I'm the president of the Board of Directors of Northern Spirit Radio, a 501c3 organization located here in Eau Claire, Wisconsin. We create and distribute content for broadcast on radio and also podcast and online listening to promote world healing and uh, social justice. Northern Spirit Radio was created 15 years ago by the visionary Mark Helpsmeet, who is right next to me. And I'm Mark Helpsmeet, and I'm the chief content creator for Northern Spirit Radio, and I must be the visionary that David's talking about. Ever since I was in high school, I've been involved in activism and social justice, including the two years that I spent in Togo, West Africa, as a member of the Peace Corps. And it feels like the work of Northern Spirit Radio is the fulfillment of the talents and the goals that I've had for my life. We are applying for a Game Changer grant to help us to live out our mission, which is to promote world healing by broadcasting inspirational and educational voices of peace and social justice using the language of personal story, music, and spirituality. We produce two shows, uh, Song of the Soul and Spirit in Action, both of which are an hour long. And uh, the hour long interview uh, is always with someone who's doing uh, social justice work uh, through uh, activism or writing, art, uh, or music. The hour-long interviews allow us to explore a topic much more deeply than other shows can manage, and that's one reason I've been a supporter of Northern Spirit Radio since it began, because that longer format allows our interviewers to ask more engaged questions and allows our guests to offer more nuanced uh, and in-depth answers. Our long-form, unhurried story sharing is an antidote to the soundbite and hurried world around us. We like to think of ourselves as media enhancers for the people who are doing the healing work for the world, including the kind of people applying for Game Changer grants. We'd like to give them a voice that can be so hard to get via commercial radio and media and via the noise of the internet. We also try and help other social justice groups, providing them a place to have their podcasts featured on our website. We began in Eau Claire on WHYS radio station, and now we're uh, carried by five other stations in Wisconsin, and we're still very rooted in the state, although we are also now carried by 40 other stations around the country, as well as being available uh, online through podcasts or through the website. Because we are located in Wisconsin, we often highlight local activism, but we provide publicity and outreach and encouragement for all sorts of people doing world healing work, including those who are addressing race and racial justice, equality, and addressing existing in in inequalities. Uh, during this month, for example, we are featuring those reaching out with compassion to immigrants on our southern border. Back in June, we covered Eau Claire's Juneteenth celebration, giving them the airtime that they deserve. Back in May, we spoke with an uh, author of Race and Social Change, and he talked about the Camp Anywhere learning experience with a diverse group of teens confronting racism. Back in April, we highlighted the work of Madison's faith-based activism group, Moses, whose top activism is around ex-prisoners, which is, as you know, the new Jim Crow. We spoke with Jennifer Harvey, who is the author of Racing White Kids, Bringing Up Children in a Racially Unjust America, about teaching kids anti-racism. We spoke with Milwaukee-based Muslim environmental activist Huda, Huda Alkoff, Confronting Prejudices on Another Front. In February, we spoke with Salika Duxworth, who is an African-American professor of history at the University of Wisconsin-Eau Claire, and dealing with civil rights and awareness. And in the past two months, we've had programs on the African plant diaspora, native land return, friending our Muslim neighbors, and much, much more all there on our website, NordenSpiritRadio.org. And this is just a glimpse. You can see it all on the website. A grant from Forward Community Investments will help us to continue to lift up the voices and the good work that is being done and also uh, help us to increase our efforts to get on more stations in Wisconsin and to get more listeners online and over the air. And on behalf of the Board of Directors, I thank you for your consideration. Thank you.